What does a lonely stick man do when the homeowner goes out? Find out in Adventures of a Stick Man, a brilliant animated film by Kate Alsebrook at St. Edmund Campion Secondary School. Well, I was just kind of sitting in class bored and thinking, you know, I wonder what would happen if a little doodle kind of came to life. And uh, I was thinking, well, you know, I've never animated a character, never made a film. And uh, so I just kind of put it aside. And then um, my school was having their first film festival. And I guess it was kind of assumed I was making a film. And they said, you're making a film. I went, sure, <laughs> yeah. So I was like, well, it's the only idea I got. <laughs> and I just kind of went with it. I learned how to animate characters and went along. Why was it assumed that you'd be entering the film festival? Uh, because people knew like I did animation and stuff, but uh, I hadn't really gone full into characters yet. I was just kind of doing basic things. And I talked about films and talked about making one before. And then uh, I guess people just thought, now's your chance. And yeah. And so you were in grade nine at the time. Yes. How do you go from never animating a character <laughs> to making a full short film about two characters? <laughs> well. Uh, like I said, I was doing animation before, and uh, so I kind of knew a lot still. It wasn't totally new to me, but then uh, tutorials, help from teachers, things like that helped me get the character modeled and rigged and ready to animate, and from there you just kind of, you learn one thing and you build on it. And by the end, I kind of knew what I was doing, so. What do you like about animation? Um, I guess that you don't have to go out and film. I know that kind of doesn't really sound good, but uh, you can work on it any time for however long you want. And uh, you, if you don't like something, it's just a few clicks away to fix it, change it up. You don't have to keep shooting it if your actors make a mistake. It's just a lot of fun. So that all being said, how long did it take to create Stickman? <laughs> um, I guess three months, three and a half. Wow. Yeah, that took a while. And so Stickman has a stick woman. Yes. I've never loved a stick romance so much. <laughs> how, how did these two characters come to each other? Um, well, I kind of kept asking. I had a half idea of a stick man that came to life. And so I started asking around, if you were a stick man and you came off the page, what's the first thing you would do? What would you want? What would you? And I was asking a whole bunch of ideas. And then somebody said, what about a stick woman? And I went, yes, that's it, stick woman, perfect. And the rest, as they say, is all history. Exactly. <laughs> and they lived happily ever after in Stick World. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and so many really cool elements, like the at last. <laughs> you just stop and you laugh. Yeah. I thought, I tried Googling cheesy uh, love song, and I went, at last. Why did I have to Google that? I knew that. <laughs> what has the response been to Adventures of a Stick Man? Uh, people, I've heard nothing but good things. I'm really impressed with uh, how it turned out. And uh, people were saying, wow, I didn't know you could animate like that. And I said, me neither. And uh, yeah, it's just been great. It's been wonderful. So now that you know what you can do, what do you want to do next? Uh, well, I do want to make another film. And I'm working on one right now for my school's film festival this year. And um, uh, going to Skills Canada, doing 3D animation there. Uh, my teammate and I, we made it to Provincials this year. So I'm looking forward to doing that and uh, just seeing what you can do. I also want to uh, dabble in uh, virtual reality because my software can now do that thanks to the update. So yeah, lots of things. <laughs> and so what's in your career horizon or have you even thought that far? Uh, well, I, I really like computers. That's how I got into it. So I was thinking uh, something along that line of working in the animation industry, but more on the computers and the art side of it. So yeah, amazing. <laughs> Anyone you want to thank? Uh, my parents for supporting me, uh, my teacher, Mr. Manano, for encouraging me and, uh, you know, ask, being really interested in what I'm doing, and uh, just everybody, my friends, and everybody who supports this. Yeah. So is this the end of Stickman, or will he go on another adventure? Uh, might be the end, because I do like to change things and use new characters and always experimenting with new things. All right, well, a bit of fond farewell to Stickman. Mm-hmm, me too. <laughs>